This is your step-by-step -step guide to installing the Ultralift standard mount cover lift onto your hot tub or spa. Begin by opening the box your cover lifter came in and check the contents against the installation guide to ensure you have all the components required. Also ensure that you have the right tools on hand. They include a 6 foot tape measure, ratchet wrench and 5 16 socket bit, 5 16 open end wrench, cordless power screwdriver or drill, and a number of cross slot or Phillips screwdriver bits. Now you are set to start the install of your new cover lifter. Step 1. Ensure that the hot tub is 16 inches or more out from any wall, obstruction or fence. This provides ample clearance for your cover to sit into once your cover lifter is installed. First, place your hot tub cover squarely over the hot tub and in the position you would like it to open and close. Now begin by inserting the two round plastic caps into the open ends of the round pivot arms. Then insert the two plastic square caps into the ends of the sliding pivot brackets. Then install the foam grips onto the corner support arms, first lubricating the interior of the foam grips for easier application. Then assemble the corner support arm by inserting it into the short support arm. Then secure them together with three number 10 self-tapping screws on each assembly. Repeat this for the opposite side of the spa. Step 2. With your cover in the closed position, begin the next step. It's time to choose the location of the mounting brackets. There are three options to choose from. Option 1. If you want your cover to act as a privacy wall, then mount the bracket just below the overhanging flap of the hard cover and at the edge of where the corner radius begins and install bracket using the supplied 1 1 quarter inch number 10 wood screws. Repeat the same process on the opposite side. Option 2 is a mid-mount installation of the mounting brackets. This option requires that you measure from the bottom lip of the acrylic to the bottom of the tub, then mark the halfway point. Then place the bottom of your mounting bracket at this mark. You just found the ideal pivot point for your cover on your hot tub. Repeat the same process on the opposite side. Option 3 is a deck mount. You can rotate your bracket for a deck mount, a deck and side tub mount, or a gazebo mount. Step 3. The next step applies to all the mounting bracket positions. Insert the sliding pivot bracket into the mounting bracket as shown and position it so the back of the bracket lines up with the back edge of the spa. Then secure both slider pivot brackets using the number 10 5 8 inch self-tapping screws. Step 4. Align the hole at the end of the slider pivot arm with the hole in the slider pivot bracket. Position the nylon washers on either side of the pivot arm and bracket. Then secure them into place by sliding through the bolt pin and secure that pin into place using the clevis pin. Repeat this step on the opposite side of the spa. For the first two installation options, the top mount position and the mid mount position you slide the long end of the corner support arm into the center pole and repeat this on the opposite side. Slide the pivot arm over the corner support arm. For the third, the deck installation, you use the shortened end of the corner support arm. Once this is complete, check to make sure that the center arm that crosses over the hard cover is one inch back of the center folding seam and that the pivot arms are one and a half inches out from the cabinet on both sides of the spa. Step 5. Step back and make sure that the pivot arms are still one and a half inches out from the spa and the center pole is sitting one inch back of the center seam. Step 6. Place a protective layer of cardboard under the cross arm and secure the arm using three number 10 5 8 inch self-tapping screws. Step 7. You're almost there. Cover the self-tapping screws and wood screws with the black plastic covers that snap over the heads of each screw, finishing the look. Then install the J-hook into the pivot bracket in the open position hole with the hard cover up. This ensures some added safety, and when the cover is down, move the J-hook to the closed position hole. You have now installed your Ultralift standard mount cover lifter. 
Remember to always fold back your cover before using the cover lifter to lift the cover into its final resting place. This ensures a longer life for your cover and cover lifter, extending your enjoyment of your spa.